Alright, getting things started right here. Here's Dalen Fuller. Uh, Wes Cabarrus running back with a big run, setting up his own short touchdown run. That's going to give them a 7-0 lead early in the first quarter. Most of the first half was a defensive game. Wes Cabarrus is going to force a fumble right here. Uh, they were very fast to the football all night long as a team defense. I was very impressed with them. Right here on the AL Brown run, they're going to force another fumble. Um, they set up their offense several times with good field position, but A.L. Brown had a good defense as well. Right here, you're going to see C.J. Gray get the ball out fast to his receiver, number three, who's making a couple nice moves right there, picking up a first down on the play. Didn't lead anywhere. You talk about A.L. Brown defense, there's an example of what they did in the first half right there. Nice tackle on the play action pass. But here, Dalen Fuller breaks a tackle. He's off to the races. This was a 59-yard touchdown run. He had two touchdowns in the game. Uh, this one gave him, uh, gave Wes Cabarrus, that is, a 13-0 lead in the first half. And at this point, you kind of felt like they were in control. Um, A.L. Brown started to get a couple things going right here. There's a nice pass right there. The number three, once again, for a first down. Didn't lead the points, though. They went out on downs. But then the A.L. Brown defense gives their offense a chance with a forced fumble right here. Return in good field position deep in West Cabarrus territory. There, Makai Harrell. Really good running back. Nice run up the middle for the touchdown. That's going to cut the lead for West Cabarrus 13-7. A muffed kickoff. Recovered by A.L. Brown sets up this C.J. Gray touchdown pass to number 18. And in a half that Wes Cabarrus really kind of dominated, A.L. Brown led 14-13 at halftime. And they went into the locker room with a lot of momentum. Third quarter, Dalen Fuller. There he is again when breaking off another big run. It didn't lead to any points, though. There were not a lot of points in the second half. But there are some good plays, like this run right here by Makai here on two good running backs tonight. A.L. Brown tries to kick a field goal without five minutes left in the game to take a four-point lead. But that field goal is blocked. A huge play right there as we continue through these highlights. There's Jared Street. This was a fourth down pass play on the last drive of the game. This was a big call right here on that same last drive of the game. There's a pass interference call. Gave valuable yardage to Wes Cabarrus. Quarterback Jared Street now showing off his dual threat ability. He's going to set this up. Game winning field goal for Wes Cabarrus. 2.6 seconds left in the game. It's good. Wes Cabarrus is going to win it. Game winning field goal. 